Okay, Super Bowl 53 is just two days away, and we know there's more to the day than just the game. That's right. Whether you're a fan of football or maybe just the commercials, right? One thing everyone seems to bond over, uh, regardless of who you're rooting for, is the food. Mm -hmm. This is accurate. Yeah. We sent our very own Frankie Catafias to the Albertsons on Broadway to show us a Super Bowl snack that'll have your friends cheering for more. Good morning, Frankie. Good morning, you guys. So I'm joined with Molly Tevis, who is the in-house dietitian here at Albertsons. And earlier we showed you guys recipes to make a more health conscious, you know, meatball recipe. You can see we've got the ground turkey, some onions, even some oatmeal. Who would have thought? So Molly, can you tell us, you know, what do we have going on here and why do we see oatmeal and ground turkey and not beef and bread carbs? Right, yeah, so I love this recipe because it's just a healthier rendition, not only on meatballs, but also on like a classic take of wings. So the oats replace the bread crumbs, giving us more of a whole grain, more fiber, more flavor, and kind of really bind that meatball together well. And then using ground turkey lightens it up, less saturated fat, and we're all just trying to be more health conscious these days. And the game day, you don't have to sacrifice all your nutrition goals, but making those healthier choices is for your you know football day spread this is an easy way to just swap out some of those heavier ingredients and add some more of those nutri nutrient dense options so you said spread that was key word here everybody's got a super bowl spread i know that for a fact and how beautiful is this how hard is it to make you know something like this look this beautiful super easy so i love pre-cut veggies so that i'm not spending time in the kitchen chopping all of them but get a wide variety of vegetables if they're there people will eat them you know you're always afraid to be that person that brings vegetables to the party be that person because people always eat them they'll inevitably grab them and have them with their meatballs with their wings with their pizza so i like them pre-cut i even like to add in maybe new vegetables people haven't tried like jicama mm -hmm. just to give it some variety and some excitement so you change it up every year so it's not always just carrots and ranch. Right. I think this is awesome too. It looks like it's really tasty. Let's maybe try a bite real quick. We're going to give you guys like our little seal of approval if we think it's yummy or not. Oh, that's good. That's actually way better than beef and breadcrumbs. Yes. And then you can sprinkle it with a little bit of, you know, blue cheese. And so adding the blue cheese instead of like blue cheese dressing lightens it up again. I love that. Guys, if you want to know this recipe, we have it posted on our website, sixonyourside.com. So make sure you check it out. It is worth making. Oh my gosh. Live in Boise, Frankie Catafias is six on your side. Oh, Frankie, oh, I'm so jealous. That looks good. Yeah, that looks so, real good right there. I never even thought about just crumbling the blue cheese on top yeah, instead of having easy. the full on dip. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Genius. Yeah.